Hello guys, this is my first video with commentary and I hope I am clear and loud enough for you guys to understand what I'm doing here. So I got this picture which is actually a panoramic image of these five shots here. That's why uh, the picture got those white borders around it. We are cropping them later. The first thing we are going to do is set the camera calibration profile to camera neutral. And then we go up to um, lens correction settings and activate those two checkboxes. Now we can start cropping the image. Okay. Now we are going to bring the highlights down a little bit. Then we are going to push the shadows just a bit. Uh, something like that. And uh, maybe add a little bit of contrast here. I think uh, this picture might be a little bit too green. This looks better. can add some clarity here. And also some vibrance. Now we can push greens a little bit bit but not too much around here and also the yellow colors this looks kind of nice we could also push the brightness of the green colors with this slider here but I think it doesn't look good in this picture I could also add a little bit of split toning especially the highlights give it a bit more warmth something like this now we are going to um, sharpen the image therefore I'm going to push the slider almost all to the right and to get a to get less noise in the background I'm going to mask out um, blurry parts of the image therefore just hold down the alt key and drag the slider to the right and you see the parts that are getting sharpened are white I think that's pretty much it what we are doing in Lightroom I'm just exporting it and we are going to process it in Photoshop Okay, I don't think this image needs much more of post-processing, but I'm just checking the options with uh, Color Effects Pro 4 from Nick Collection. I might add a little vignette right here, but not too much. Something like that. Now, the next thing I might add is a bit of, of the Orton Glow effect. Alright, I think the first preset is a bit too much, it's too bright, I think I'm going with the second one. And maybe uh, put a bit more into the strength slider. The next thing I'm going to do is create a layer mask on the glow layer. And then just take a black brush and uh, just make the mushrooms a bit more clearer. This looks good. The next thing I'm going to do is uh, pushing the contrast a little bit just for the mushrooms. Uh, something like this. Now I'm going to fill the layer mask with a black color. Choose a white color for my foreground and just brush the mushroom parts where I want to add more contrast. A bit of dodge and burn to bring out the mushrooms even more. Maybe a bit too much. I just down the opacity a bit. Something like this. I'm also going to bring up um, the green moss on the ground. Just a little bit. And maybe the lights in the back to make the mushrooms pop out more. Something like that. Yes, I think this is pretty much it. Um, if you have any questions regarding this tutorial, then just let me know in the comment section. Um, and I'm going to answer it as fast as possible. Thank you.